The FAA and NTSB are continuing to investigate a deadly crash Saturday at a Tennessee air show. The single plane crash claimed the life of Louisville native Jay Gordon. Gordon was an experienced aviator who performed in air shows across the country, but most notably, he was a crowd favorite at Thunder Over Louisville for nearly two decades. WLKY's Annalisa Gale spoke to those that knew Gordon. She joins us now with more. Annalisa? Lauren, the friends I spoke with say Jay Flash Gordon was passionate about his family and flying. Today, they are left saddened by the news that he was killed while doing what he loved. I was just heartbroken. I mean, every time I would see something on the news about a plane crash or something at an air show, I'd say, oh my God, I hope it's not Jay. But on Saturday, Jerry Pignotti's worst fears came true. That deadly crash on the news involved his friend and former boss, Jay Gordon. Gordon had been the pilot inside the L-39 Albatross that crashed around 4.30 that afternoon during the Wings Over Big South Fork Air Show in Scott County, Tennessee. When we saw the puff of smoke and, you know, he did not come back, you know, it was a uh, heart drop. And I got a phone call last night. It just tore me up. Gordon is best remembered for his years of dedication to Thunder over Louisville. 2013 marked his 15th year show. That year, he took WLKY behind the scenes. I was born and raised here. It's a lot of fun to be here. Uh, it's a great event. Kick off the Derby. Very special uh, being able to do this. And it is, you just, when else do you get to go through downtown Louisville upside down at five, right near the ground at 500 miles an hour? And just this year, he once again showed off his skills, taking WLKY's Rick Van Hoos along for the ride. I don't know if you believe me, not, but I was like, I put my hands on the canopy like that. It's like, nope, you've got it. You're flying the airplane. Thunder over Louisville producer Wayne Hedinger released this statement Sunday night, saying in part, as a family, the Thunder Team and Derby Festival are helping one another as we collectively try to find a way to help ease the pain and sorrow for his wife, Shirley, and his children. He went on to say, may God bless and hold our dear friend and buddy forevermore. Friend and fellow Louisville pilot Mike Mountjoy says Thunder over Louisville will never be the same. Well. I'm, I'm sure there are others who, who will take his place, but certainly he's been very involved for a long time uh, with Thunder, so he'll be missed for sure. And Lauren Gordon leaves behind a wife and two children. He was the president and founder of Gordon Darby. The company helped design state emissions inspection programs. I'm Nalisa Gale, WLKY News.